Okay, you're going to be working with two types of problems today. You're going to be working with problems where you have a triangle and the three interior angles of the triangle. And you're going to have problems where you will have two interior angles and one exterior angle. So let's go back for the first type of problem. We have triangle FGH. You need to sketch a picture. F G H. F is 3x minus 15, and I don't have enough room to write that on the inside. G is 8x plus 8, and then H is 2x plus 18. So those are the three angles that you have. All right, you will add those three angles together, and it's going to equal 180 degrees. So let's do that. 3x minus 15 plus 8x plus 8 plus 2x plus 18. That's going to equal 180 degrees. x is going to equal 13. All right, so now what was the question asking for? Oh, it's asking for the value of x. So you would just type 13 into your answer box and hit submit. Um, make sure that the question is asking for the value of x, because if not, and it asks, say, for angle h, you would then have to take that and substitute it and get your angle h. Um, so just be careful of, of what the question is asking for. Now, the second kind of question is this. In QRS, triangle QRS, QS is extended through point S to point T. So that means this QS line down here at the bottom we're going to make it a little bit longer, and we're going to put this point T. All right. And now QRS, which is the angle up here at the top, that's X plus 8. And RST is 4X plus 11. And then SQR is X plus 13. So you've got to be careful. These problems, you have to read the angles and make sure that you're putting the measurements in the appropriate spots, okay? Now, for this one, this is that exterior angles um, theorem, and this theorem says that these two interior angles will equal that exterior angle. So now we type in x plus 13 plus x plus 8 and it's going to equal that one on the outside. x is 5. Alright, well, let's use my pen. x equals 5. What is my question asking for? RST. All right, RST is that exterior angle. So for this one, we do have to substitute. So that would be 20 plus 11, and then that would be 31. So this time, type in 31, hit submit. So make sure you are sketching a picture. Double check to make sure that you're labeling things correctly. And then finally, make sure you are answering the correct question. Make sure you're answering what the question is asking for.